Hello, hello, hello. You are here because you want to learn about Sprout Social. It's a social media management tool. What does that mean? It's a tool that will help you post your social media ahead of time so you can schedule it, post on several, several different platforms, and then forget about it and then till the next time. So that's what a social media management tool is. Now this one I'm going to show to you today. I've been reviewing different ones. So if you want to see all of them, you're searching, go to my playlist. I have a link below. I also have a link down there for Sprout Social, the one I'm showing you today, in case this is something you want to dig in deeper to. But I'm just going to do a basic review to tell you what it offers and maybe this is something that you're looking for it'll save you a little bit of time so let's dig in uh, my name is Vanessa DeBerlay and I have a channel called affiliate marketing mastery where I teach you how to earn a passive income however I also teach you on my channel different things like email marketing social media management platforms and tools uh, different funnels that you can use so all the different tools you can use to build a business so if you're not doing affiliate marketing it's okay because there's lots of information that will apply to your business and I post every single day and I guarantee you most of my videos will be roughly 10 minutes give or take I try not to stay here too long because I do value your time all right so let's look at this real quick now do know um, in a nutshell this one seems a little bit more advanced than the others that I've looked at however if you here's my uh, thing I'm, we're gonna look at it and then we'll talk about the cost and why you would want this one or why you wouldn't okay I'm not gonna lie to you if you're brand spanking new you might think well shoot I don't want that but there are certain people who are new that would want this so we're, we'll talk about that in a minute but it is kind of like an all-in-one box a one-stop shop it not only helps you post your uh, social media post on different platforms but it also helps you to analyze a lot of different things like your engagement and who's who's following you who's watching you and all these different analytics which i think if you're really big into the social media platform this really does a lot now if you're just looking for something to schedule your posts and you're not really into the social aspect or engagement part then this one probably isn't for you so I'm not gonna you know I just want to point that out so you see some of the different things there I'm not gonna sit here and read to you either um, here is a snapshot of some of the M um, of, of posting what I love about this one any one of the social media platforms that I show you will have a way for you to put your post into a calendar and it's very visual I love that but what I love about this is it will tell you hey you can take the same post and put it on three or four different places and we're going to show you where that post is that's what I love about this I have been using um, I basically used a social media planner just to post because in my marketing I'm more into the search based marketing where I do more into keywords and things like that I'm not really out trying to throw ads and things in front of people as much as I want them to search for me so there's two different kinds of marketing um, but this I love the one that I'm using is post planner and it just basically I can go into the calendar and put them in but it doesn't show me like hey the same post is in three different places I really like this feature um, because you can see it you can see where you've posted them and you can use the same content in different places so that is a plus in my eyes now the next one I wanted you to see here that you in the analytics that you can look at your audience demographics and that's really important if you're on Instagram Facebook all these different places where you're trying to target a certain audience and a lot of times when we're in business we target a certain audience and then as you go along for several months you might start getting these um, analytics and you'll go wow I was targeting females 20 to 35 and I find that females from 35 to 50 are following me so you know then you can rethink your messaging and stuff because for some reason you've attracted a different crowd and that's going to happen that's why just a tip when you're asked to pick your market go ahead and pick one and don't overthink it and talk to that audience and then start looking at your analytics and sometimes you might have to tweak things um, I know I spent a lot of time with that and really I it, it made me really frustrated and when analytics started coming in, I'm like oh okay this is where I need to be 
talking or, or targeting. All right, so the, that's just an example. Um, here's another snapshot of your followers. So you can see that 52% of this one is male, 48% is female, which is kind of 50-50. But you see your Twitter stats, um, the different things, um, and then your daily engagement. Remember, um, you want it, if you're really into the social engagement part, you can track that. Did this post really get people to engage? Because that's what I'm looking for. And that's what I want to track. And it's right here. Uh, Sprout Social will track that for you. Now let's talk about some of the pros and cons. Before we do that though, I wanna bring up the pricing because I told you it was pricey, so I want you to see it. And again, don't let this um, turn you off. Again, I don't use it because I'm not into the social engagement part, but you do get a 30-day free trial. Go in and, and try it out and, 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 and play with it. Now the standard one, you can already look at the prices, is $99 a month and you're like, wow, that's a lot. But if you are brand new and you're already rocking it on Instagram or Facebook and you've got thousands of followers and you love to engage and you're, you're just that person, then go for it. You this, plat, this program would probably be good for you. You're already doing that social media part. Now you just have to find a way to schedule and then add that element. Um, if you are looking to start a business where you might have other people coming in, um, maybe you're, you're helping other people build their social media platform, then you would want to look at the professional account. Or maybe you have a virtual assistant coming in to help you. And I've talked about this before, but not everybody sees every video. So if you follow every single video, I apologize for being repetitive, but you can start a business where you will post for other people and they pay you to do that. And then you would absolutely want one of these bigger, um, memberships so that you can handle everything but here's the biggest thing on a standard to professional you can only do five social profiles and over on professional you can post on 10 at a time so again if you're brand new you probably are not on five platforms right now you hopefully have learned that you should be focusing on one and really growing it and once you are in the the mood the, you know the groove of posting on it all the time you've got it going you've got a good following then you add another one i know that um you see all these gurus out there and they're all over the place one they probably have people helping them and two they weren't all over the place in the beginning so just focus on one and again i've got post planner down there it's I think it's like three dollars a month it's really cheap that's you know and it'll it'll i think you can get on three platforms three to five i can't remember right off the top of my head but um and you go in and you can post and that helps you get it started if you get really big into the social media and things i definitely would would uh, suggest this one again i'm not an affiliate on this i'm just trying to give you some information to help you make some good decisions in your business all right so that's that in a nutshell try out the 30-day free trial go in there and play with it you're going to learn more from actually doing it than listening to me and that's why i don't typically like to do tutorials because these programs all have tutorials and you can um, fly around and look in directions that you need to go and not just follow where I think you need to go, if that makes sense. All right, so let's look at the pros and the cons, okay, of this is this platform. Um, some of the pros, it's gorgeous, it's very pretty, and some people like that. It's much more attractive than some of the others. It's very, the layout is really nice. It's very easy to look at, easy to work with. So it's not, um, maybe we could say it could be social media management for dummies, right? It's very, very easy. They do have excellent from um, support, tech support and customer support. So that's important, especially if you're new and you're not real techie and it's headache free. Um, you can, You can go onto this platform and figure it out and it's not real stressful. And I know, especially if you're not real techie, that can be so stressful if you're trying to figure something out and you just want to cry sometimes. And with the support and the flow and how easy it is to use with this platform, you're getting your money's worth if that's important to you. Now let's look at some of the cons. Um, of course, I, um, one of the cons definitely would be that it is pricier. I didn't list that, but it is pricier. But in my opinion, you get what you pay for. Um, it, like anything else, if you pay low prices, you'll get less services. You pay higher, you get more. So that's just the way it is. But um, from here, I have done um, a review of Buffer 
and uh, Sprout Social is not as advanced as Buffer with the scheduler. So you, again, want to go into each of them and see. Now you might get on this one and say, you know what, this is advanced enough. I don't need anything more advanced, so don't need to be on Buffer. Um, at that point, you might want to start comparing prices. Um, Facebook, as of this video, has not allowed people to like your content. Um, could be fixed by the time this gets out. So. Facebook is always changing their rules. So again, there may be other things that they don't allow um, as we go forward. All right, so that is it for today. And don't forget to hit the Sprout social link below. Again, I'm not an affiliate for that. Um, hit the link and go in and try their 30 day free trial. They do not have a free account. So if you're looking for free forever, then don't even take your time to look um, because you already know going in that it's about $100 a month. If that just scares you and you absolutely don't wanna do it, then don't look at it. Go look at some of the other ones that I've listed. So I'm gonna also put down below my playlist for social media, ma media management tools. Um, there's other videos in there that you can look at. And I also am offering you a guide to earning income online. If you're looking at this and you're like, you know, I wanna make money online, I don't know where to begin, I have a free guide, you can click that and look at that as well. And that's all I got for you today. So of course, don't forget to subscribe, give me a thumbs up and all that crap. But um, <laughs> I, I put videos out every day and like I said, keep them, you know, in that window of 10 minutes so that, um, and value your time. So, you know, if you have any questions, ask, and I can create videos based on your needs. This is for you. It's not for me. So definitely put your comments below. Let me know what you're thinking. Let me know what you need. All right. Till I see you on the next video. Thank you for watching.